Today we're gonna be battling a ton of the new Rocket Leaders and hopefully get some of their brand new shiny shadow Pokemon. I've got myself an Arlo here on the balloon, so we're gonna beat him up while Adam over here tries to show me some sort of card stuff. Now one thing I forgot to mention to you guys is that Arlo has shiny shadow Cagnia, which is a pretty good one. That's really cool that they did that. Sierra has Trap Inch, so hopefully Sierra will be better to us this time. She definitely wasn't last time. And Clifford has Machop again, which is a good one, but luckily if you already have that set, you don't need to focus on it. But anyways, let's see if we get an orange Cagnia right Right here. We don't. Okay. I have no idea what the hundo is. This is a 239, so we'll take a look at it once we catch it. Maybe it's a good one. Not that we overly need a good Shadow Cagnia, but of course it broke out of the ball. Get in the ball. You know what? Actually, no. Adam, have you ever caught a Shadow Cagnia before? I have not. All right, well, here you go. Magic throw right here. Bang. All right, he's, you've got this. You've got this. I think so. One. We'll see. Dose. See? It was easy. Yeah! You know, he's. I'm getting him back into the game. I'm getting him back in the game. He's been gone for a little while. We're gonna keep him, especially because he just gave me a hundo. No, he did not give me a hundo. This is a 653, but you know what? It's our first of many. Well, unfortunately, our time in Maryland has come to an end. I'm about thank to fly God. out. Yeah, thank God, sure. Oh, it was a good time hanging out with you, though. It was good Always. seeing you again. I mean, we've been we've known each other for, what, like, eight, nine years? Longer than that. Yeah, yeah, long time. He's now a Viking now. He's got like a ginger beard. He never had that before, so that's Burr. great. But anyways, Adam, you get your final chance to redeem yourself on a shiny shadow. Go ahead, get that Cagnia. I'm feeling it right here, right now. Oh, nope. Nope, definitely not. But anyways, good seeing you, homie. And oh, is he gonna land the hit? Oh, wow, that's good. For a guy who never plays this game, you're doing pretty good. And you got curveballs down. I've improved you're since last hour. Oh. Yeah, that last hour has been fantastic. But how good is this Cagnia? Will he redeem himself on those IVs? Because I don't think so. Eh, maybe a little better. Well, on that note, I'm going to get on the plane. Whoops. Love your face, buddy. Good I seeing you. Now that we're at the airport, I do want to check something real quick. Do we have any leaders? Okay, there are a few leaders, including one that's just over there. We should be able to reach that stop without having to go too far because my terminal's right here. But yeah, we'll see what we can do. When I get home, we're going to be able to do a lot of leaders, but I also have like a connection in another area. So we'll see what happens. And hopefully this leader right over here isn't a cliff because we don't want a cliff. Well, I'm very happy to say we have another Arlo. For some reason, Arlo's showing up a lot, but I'm not complaining. We only need to get two Cagnias, so hopefully we'll get one here. And so far, the team I have right here has been doing fantastically. Cario pretty much resists everything the Cagnia has and has enough energy to take out the middle thing. And then usually if there's something really bad for him in the back, we have Reshiram and we have our Swampert to deal with them. And here we have defeated Arlo yet again. I also completely forgot to mention that Shiny Sand Isle is in the egg, so hopefully we'll pick up an egg. There we go. I unfortunately do have some eggs on me, which is not the best, but things didn't quite work out for hatching those. Anywho, though, let's take a look at this one. Not a shiny shadow cacnea. Not a big deal, though. It's all good, but now that we're catching this, I have to go through security real quick, so I'll see you when we get through security. We are now through security, but of course, we're gonna keep doing leaders. Another Arlo was in here, and not a shiny shadow with him. This one's a 256, though, so this one's slightly better, so that's great. And it looks like our last leader in the airport is a Sierra. We will do it in a second, but first, let's click on the Bouffalant, just because it is the regional from here. I've been seeing them this entire time, which has been fantastic. I'm trying to get enough XLs to max at least two of them. I want to max my hundo, but you never no, we could get a good shiny one in the future, yada yada. So catching as many of them as possible is nice. Here's our first Sierra of the video, though technically it's not the first one I've ever done. This is my second one. I had a balloon like really early in the morning. Anywho though, not a green trap inch. I feel like this one might take a while to finish, especially because we need to get three of these things. But with that, that is the last leader here in the airport. Now, even though there are no more rocket leaders in this airport, we did complete these timed researches. I had to defeat six grunts, which there were plenty of them in here. And I had to catch 25 dark types to get all those done. So let's just finish this one first. Name all of the rocket radar pieces, which means we will get two radars technically from this. At the end here, you also get a rocket radar and a super incubator, which is nice. But I don't know what the encounter is going to be. I have not looked ahead. It's a pawn yard. That is so cool. Good luck to you guys. I hope you guys get a shiny of that. I still think it's boosted. And if it is, let me know in the comments down below if you got it, because that's so cool. You don't get to see that in the wild too often. I think the only other time it was in the wild was during a... It was GoFest, I want to say. Yeah, like the New York GoFest they were showing up. This one's bad, though. You want to get something way better than a 582. Now let's just get all this XP for the second one where we had to catch all the dark types. I'm curious what we're going to get for this one. So let's find out. We're going to get five hyper potions. We're going to get ourselves five revives and then an encounter with a Vullaby. Pretty neat. 517 as well. I don't believe that's very good, but I'm actually not too sure. I don't think I've ever gotten a research Vullaby before. And I don't know if these are boosted now because they made them pretty much mass spawn in the wild, but maybe they are. So good luck. Hopefully you get that one too. Anywho though, this one is an 11, 11, 13. Not great. Now that we finished all that, let's get on our flight and I'll see you in Charlotte.
Well, I've got some good news and I've got some bad news. Good news is I'm in Charlotte and I'm at my gate. The downside is that my flight is delayed, though admittedly that's also a good thing because I literally landed here with maybe, I want to say, zero minutes remaining until we were supposed to board. So as much as I don't like delays, this actually did help me out quite a bit. As I ran over though, I did do a Sierra because of course I'm gonna do that. Unfortunately, it wasn't shiny, but my 4 p.m. balloon is in and there was another Arlo, so no shiny shadow catnip from this one, unfortunately. There are two more leaders here, but I'm honestly not gonna run off and try to get them. They're on the other side of the whole terminal and stuff like that. And I kind of want to stay here and make sure that the flight is good. So we'll see what happens. And as I was talking, I didn't even look at the CP. Yeah, this isn't good. This is a 242. Apparently 280 is the Honda. So here's a fun update for you all. We're currently still in the plane. I've been on here since about four and it is six now, so that's great. On the upside, we do have ourselves another rocket balloon that didn't have a shiny in it, and this is a bad cadmium. This is a really bad cadmium, but oh well, at least we get to do stuff, but I don't know how much we're gonna be able to get done today because of this flight delay, but we'll see what we can do. Well, I'm very happy to say that we are finally home and we have two Arlos here. One for my balloon and one in the wild, but sadly, this one is not a shiny. 239. Well, let's catch this guy real quick and then we're going to go for the other one that's literally right here. Unfortunately, it is 854, so the odds of me being able to do a lot more of these today is pretty low. Now, before we do this next Arlo, let's just do a quick shiny check. No, no shiny Carnivine. But fun to see different regionals, right? Anyways, let's do this one. And here's the other Arlo and no shiny shadow from this one at 250 yet again. That is 30 up the Honda. And I I don't know how many more of these we'll be able to do today, but hopefully we'll get a handful more here in the airport. One hour later. We are very close to home now, and this is the last leader I'm gonna be able to do. It's 9.58, though admittedly we'll still have balloons and stuff, but it, it's an Arlo that is not shiny. But 2.57, so not the best we've seen, but not the worst either. And now we're finally back home and it feels really good, though unfortunately we're back much later than I wanted to be. I was hoping to be like home a couple hours sooner than this, so then I could do a whole bunch more leaders and we could have just smashed them all out. But unfortunately, nature had other plans and those storms were apparently pretty bad. And I mean, I'm not gonna lie though, the flight home was awful. It was literally turbulence the entire time. But while I was in the Uber home, I did get two shinies. I got a Volo in the wild, so it does look like they're boosted. But to add extra proof to that, I incensed a shiny one as well. Well, so they're definitely shiny boosted. A lot of people have been reporting getting them. So make sure you take advantage of this while you can. This is a huge deal. We have not had Volobee in the wild ever, minus through daily instances, they would rarely ever show up. For the most part, they've only been in the 12 kilometer eggs, which obviously is kind of a hard barrier for people to get through in order to get this shiny. This is your perfect time to get one. Make sure you click on as many of them as you can. It is about a one in 50 to one in 64 odd rate. So odds are you're probably gonna get one if as long as you click on quite a few of them. And again, usually locked to 12 kilometer eggs, that's a pretty big deal. So please do click on as many of these as you can. Also, I wanna complete this world of Wonders taken over 202. This is the World of Wonders like ticket thing. Somebody bought this for me and unfortunately I didn't get a ping for it so I don't know who did it but thank you whoever did it. I really do appreciate it even if I don't say who's the one who gifted it. I really do appreciate it happening. I just I don't know where to look to see like who did it because it never shows up in the journal. Anywho though let's claim our pineapple berries and then we will claim our final rewards here and these are the final rewards period so we're gonna get ourselves a max potion, a max revive and we're getting an encounter with a another poniard. Pretty cool and a 592 so not much better, but still kind of cool. Also, because of the travel, I completely forgot about this. It's a Rocket World, one of five, so let's claim the rewards here and see what we get for these. I mean, we're gonna get some Pokeballs, Pineapps, and a Rocket Radar piece. Well, let's see what our encounter turns into after we get all this XP. Maybe it'll be a cool one. It's an Apom, not exactly as cool as those Boneyards and stuff like that, but whatever. And for page two of five, we must catch 20 Pokemon, purify five Shadow Pokemon, and then defeat 16 Go Rocket Grunts, which I've already done quite a bit of today but oh well, we're gonna have to wait until later to actually complete this. And on the upside, I don't have to rush through this because I already got my rocket radar for my grout on, so this'll be here forever until I finally choose to complete it. Once again, I'd like to apologize for not doing as many rocket leaders as I usually do in these videos, but again, it's all came down to the airplane and the weather and stuff like that, and there was really nothing I could do about it. But luckily, we are home now, and we are going to be going hard on this event. We are gonna be clicking on so many Volobies. We're gonna be doing a ton of leaders, and I promise that the video are gonna be much more consistent now that there isn't as much distractions going on like with the family and everything like that. But on that note, I really hope you enjoyed today's video and if you did, please smash that subscribe button for me, show me some love, and let me know in the comments down below, have you managed to get a shiny Volibi or any of the brand new shiny shadows? Please let me know. And if you really enjoy the content and you wanna see even more of it, I highly suggest this video over here. But with that being said, I'll see you in the next one.